some viewers may find the following video disturbing. Viewer discretion is advised. Well, hello, and welcome back to the channel, everybody. Today's video takes us to Jacksonville, Florida, where uh, Looney Lana tries to get into a uh, public school board meeting and, uh, well, ends up getting booted out of the building. So let's go ahead and sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. We're here at the Duval County Public Schools here in Jacksonville, Florida. Go and make sure they respect our rights to record the public. Do a little employee conduct check. Question, Lana. Who the hell made you their boss? Who the hell made it where you checked their conduct? I mean, come on now, Lana. We all know you're just there to uh, piss people off. Just to go ahead and admit it already. Yeah. Right. 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 I want to speak to your manager. Oh, so you're not going to identify yourself in a school safety zone, you dumbass? Because, well, anything in the state of Florida uh, that's a school area is considered to be a school safety zone. And uh, they can and will trespass you off of that property between uh, one hour before their operating time and one hour after their operating time. So, yeah, that's what got Joey a uh, surreal camera trespassed here recently from another school, and I'm sure you should have learned your lesson uh, at other schools by now within Florida, unless you are a very slow learner, which I'm sure that must be the case by now. It's a public meeting, though. It is a public meeting, yeah. but you need to, everybody needs ID, that you need to sign yeah, can I, all posted around. Can I speak to a supervisor? It ain't gonna make a difference, you still can't come in here and go find an ID. What's the problem? She's gonna come here and find ID. Can I speak to her? Okay. Are you getting a supervisor? She's, she's oh, okay. okay. getting a hold of somebody. Okay. Hi. How's it going? I'm just trying to get to the public meeting. Are you a supervisor? Uh, not a supervisor. I'm only law enforcement. Oh, yeah. Them. Are you, what are you, JSO? Uh, no, school board. Oh, school board. School board yeah, yeah, I just yeah, want to go to the public meeting. Out. Yeah. Yeah, but I think what the, your policy uh, I, is. Yeah, I can give you my name. I don't have an ID with me. Yeah, now. I think the policy is you have to have a. a yeah, but this floor, the Florida laws, the law, not the policy, says that I'm allowed to attend the meeting. I don't. Okay, Lana, you're allowed to attend the meeting without identifying yourself? Okay, go ahead and show me the statute on that. Show me the citation. Otherwise, I think you're just pulling this right out of your damn ass. Hear what your policy says? Mm -hmm. Obviously, you'll know that I'll be unarmed. You're going to scream me, I'm assuming. Mm -hmm. So I don't understand. I could give you my, my name. Well, you can ask to talk to a higher authority and try to seek one out somewhere. Yeah, I just want to attend the public meeting just like the Florida Law, uh, Act. The Florida sure. Public Meetings Act says right. that I'm allowed to attend. Well, so I'm not sure why you're refusing. Well, they've got rules. I don't care what the rules to, are. Yeah. We help them enforce those rules. I understand that. Yeah, I just want to but, go to the public meeting. But without that ID, how do you think you can get across there safely into the meeting? Well, you're going to scream me. So what's my name going to provide? Like, what's that going to do? I'm kind of confused. Well, the law does a valid picture But that's a policy. That's not a law. Yeah. You're a law enforcement, right? Are you a sworn law enforcement? Well, oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, I just, I'm just curious. Officer. Yeah. Just yeah, so I just want to tell you, pardon? I just so I know how, how, how this is going to go. You're kind of school police. Yeah. yeah. Well, you're a sworn Florida officer. Yeah. So you, you, you raise your right hand and swear an oath to the Constitution of Florida law. Right. I'm just, I'm just, that's what I was asking. So you're obviously going to know that I'm going to be unarmed. So what's the, what's my name going to provide? Well, I don't know how you're going to get in there without the ID. So that's what we're trying to negotiate. 
Well, I mean, you're going to know that it'll be unarmed. I, the Florida, the Florida Public Meetings will Act says that I'm allowed to go in there to the meeting. So, yeah. this is this policy. I don't care about the policy. I told you I'd give you my name. Yeah, I understand. I think yeah. we kind of reached the end of our conversation. Okay. So, uh, do you have you somebody want, that's that's yeah, above you? Yeah. If you want to get some, uh, yeah, if you want to get some idea, we can, whoever's in charge of your building, uh, they might want to come down and try some conversation. We yeah. Come down. Okay. Yeah. So all we do right now is just enforce. The so you're so you're refusing Valley. access to the Florida the Florida Public Meetings uh, Act. I'm refusing access. Yeah. I have the idea of state. I told you I'd give you my name. Have a good day. Okay. Well, I'm going to come on in then. I mean, since you're refusing. By law, I'm allowed to. And by law, they can trespass your sorry ass right out the freaking door, Lana. In fact, how many more buildings are you going to be trespassed out of before you give up this gig and eventually realize how much of an ignoramus you are? But of course, I don't think you'll ever figure that one out. I mean, it would take someone of uh, at least a small amount of intelligence to figure that out th at the very least. Well, I'm telling you right now, I yeah. want access to the building. I would like to go to the public meeting. All right, well, talk to don't, can. Don't, do not don't touch me. Head. Well, I'm, I'm telling you that you can scream me. You got to move over to the side. Well, I would like to go into the public meeting, sir. Why don't you move over to the side. I, I'm trying to get to the public meeting, sir. Which meeting do you get? No, you cannot pass not without the ID. I told you I'd give you my name. You got your name. Just take that off. Not sufficient. Why is that? So you had to give up your Fourth Amendment to go? To, no. Oh, come on now, Lana. Do you play this with the doctors when you have to go in for a checkup that it'll violate your Fourth Amendment right to show your ID to get your checkup done? I mean, do you try that with the doctors? I'm wondering, because if you do, I'm sure... Uh, you don't get very many health checkups, do you? Because, well, I doubt they would play that game with you. Okay, well, I'd like to speak to the supervisor then. Who's your supervisor? I'm going to move over there and have a seat, and we'll see if we can find somebody. She already told me that she's not coming in, so I would like to go we'll call under the floor. Supervisor. Okay, I would love to speak to your supervisor. But you can't wait right here. you got to move over. Well, I'm trying to get through line, sir. I'm trying to get to the public meeting. It starts at 9, so right now I'm 10 minutes late. Well, did you say 9 o'clock? If it's 9 a.m., then you are well within the time of the school safety zone. So, if that's the case, it's understandable that they would be protecting this place from imbeciles like you. I mean, get freaking real, Lana. You're playing a dangerous game here. One which you will not win when it comes to the safety of well, anybody within the school system, they don't play around with that kind of thing. I'm trying to go through your screening process, but you're not wanting to screen me, so I'd like to go to the public meeting. So either screen me or I would like to go back there, sir. Yeah. We'll see how it's going to happen. Okay. Yeah, I do. Okay. Bone? I mean, I told you I would submit to the screening. I'm not sure what's the problem. Well, I mean, that's to, what law is. I'm trying to tell you, I get you. If you give us a few minutes here, I'm trying to call somebody. My yeah, supervisor. Yeah, certainly. Uh, he's not on ground. Well, I'm going to wait in line because that's I'm next gonna, in line. Well, we don't have a line right here. Right, right. right. Here. Yeah. yeah. You're in, in the way. Oh, oh, well, I'm trying to get through. I'm not in the way. I'm trying to process through. All right, what the? Uh, yeah. I'm trying to conduct business. I'm trying to get through. I'm not sure why I can't get through. Don't shush me. It's called First Amendment. And how do you say? Oh, Lana, did he trigger you with that? Shh. Well, allow me to shush you right now. I mean, oh, it's my First Amendment right. Oh, no. He can shush you, and it's his First Amendment right to do so if you want to play that little game, because that's freedom of speech, you little dummy. You don't have to get triggered over it. I mean, he has his right to freedom of speech, which, to, which was to shush you, and you have the right to your freedom of speech, which is to open that gigantic pie hole of yours. Graham, like the cracker? Yeah, okay. Um, she's, I can't even check these people in. She's in the way. I'm trying to get checked through so I can go to the public meeting, sir. Florida Public Meetings Act. You might want to look it up. That's law. You know, Lana, I ended up uh, finally finding that uh, statute. Uh, while it is open to the public, there is nothing in there about uh, not identifying yourself. It's In fact, it's not even mentioned, which I'm sure it's left open to the uh, school board in this particular case 
to request the identification cards of anybody who is going to be attending that meeting, which is for safety purposes, of course, you dipshit. Your little policy's not law, sir. I told you I'd give you my name. I don't have a problem with that. That's just good. You know, so I'm down here holding down a meeting like we discussed. And did uh, your security staff call and tell you about the confusion? Well, we have somebody that wants to come in without proper ID, and that's where the standoff is. Yeah, but you don't need proper ID. That's not law. Yes. Well, currently where we're at is we're just going to deny her entry uh, until uh, you know, the meeting's over, until she leaves, whatever, you know, whatever breaks down first. Yeah, I'm letting you know. Yeah, 10 -4. Yeah, come on down if you can. Huh? Huh. Yo, is that usual? Come down. Yeah. Who's, is that who's well, as usual, Lana has no new or original arguments. She's just going to talk in circles this whole time with this particular gentleman right here. So let's just go ahead and jump on ahead to where the uh, superior arrives. And uh, well, she still doesn't get in. So let's roll that beautiful bean footage, shall we? Many, many minutes later. Welcome Big Sarge. Hey, how are you? Good. What's your name, sir? What's your name? Sergeant Wilson. Wilson. Be nice if we had some elevator music, huh? So, Grant, what do we uh, what do we have with this young lady? What do we have? Uh, we, yeah, what's her name? Yeah, that's a press. That's my press badge. Yeah. Okay. So basically, me, so it's basically me. what it is, it's called the Florida Public Meetings Act. Yes. So I like to go. And I told your uh, your officer here that I have no problem going through security. Okay. You'll know that I have no weapons. Okay. So I'm not sure what my name's going to provide uh, you, other than if you want to put your items here on the table uh -huh. and you can go through security. Okay. Okay. Do right. that. Without producing Yeah. 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 In public areas. Can I set my stuff over here? Oh, you put it over there. Yeah. Well, well you got security set. I think it's security set over there. Yeah, but I want to be able to get it once I get put through security. Put it on security. the table right there. Yeah, I want to be able to, can I get it once I get through there? Did you hear what I said? Okay. Put it on the table. Okay. Okay. He's over the public media. What's that? He's over the public media. So go back here and talk. I'm just getting the public media, sir. Okay, so uh, they want you to talk to their media person, which is pretty much how a lot of this stuff goes down. Anyway, if you want to record a meeting or something like that, you go to the media person in charge and find out, well, all the general information that you need, and they'll let you go do your business. And I'm sure J-Town is going to cooperate with them. Uh, yeah, no, probably not. Also be bringing in wow. 
Why are you Follow getting so close to me? Yes. Follow our directions, okay? I don't need to. It's a public okay. space, sir. It's a public meeting. It's a public space. It's a public meeting, sir. You're not yes. going to believe me. But you're going to sit You're getting out. way too close. Can we get... Let's have a lead. Yeah, you're the Let's one who's dropped out Let's have a lead. Sir, what are you doing? You What are you doing, sir? What are you doing? What are you... Can you let me go? What are you doing? What are you... Jesus! What are you doing, sir? What are you? I'm sitting here filming the public meeting. What are you doing? Why are you grabbing me like this? Why are you grabbing me like this? Let me go. Get off of me, sir. Get off. Stop. Yeah. What the hell are you doing, sir? What in the world? I was sitting there filming a public meeting, sir. And a, and a public. Try to come back here again in this building. You'll be arrested for trespassing. What are you doing, sir? What are you doing? You're literally put, get your hands off of me. What is your issue? Outside, ma'am. What is okay. your issue? Why are you putting your hands on me, sir? He was asked, ma'am. I don't need. A it's a public space. Okay. We're actually. Why are you getting so close to me? Well, actually, you're getting. So you're close trespassing to me. me now. You, you just walked up to me. to me. Okay. So we asked you one time to uh, go ahead and have a seat if you was going to attend the meeting. You refused to do so. So now we're going to ask you to leave. So I'm being okay? trespassed. Well, you I'm will be you, since you're being not following. Us. Okay. I'm asking you. Am I being trespassed? Okay. Well, you're not going to attend the meeting if you can't follow our directions. Okay. I don't need to. It's a okay. public meeting. Thank you. I appreciate. Okay, time. I would like What's to go back name? in there. And that's a Karen Mac. That's Karen. Video. Yeah. Okay. Can I go? Uh, no. I would like to attend it, sir. No. Look you're at not. you. You are done for the day. Wow. Yes. Wow. And what's your name? JT Wilson. Mm hmm. Do you have a badge number? Mm hmm. Good. I love bringing blue line thugs to the federal court. Mm hmm. Oh, yeah. Thank you, ma'am. I, I would like to go to a public meeting, no. sir. So, am I being trespassed? I'm asking you. It's a simple You're about question. about to be arrested. For what? What You're about, about to be arrested, okay? If I don't leave the property, if what's... You, if you come within this space here again... What space? You have my to be more, space. Your space. Yes. So you walking up to me. Yes. Have I moved? Well, you did this earlier. No, have I it's moved? It's all on camera. Okay, that's fine. You haven't at this present completely, time. Completely. But when you were over that's here, you came up to me. Completely. Thank you. So what would the charge be? Thank you. What would the charge be? We appreciate it. What would your charge be? Well, Karen, we don't need to have that That's discussion, Karen okay? Magnet. That's to attract uh, the Karens. Uh, I don't understand okay. why people, it goes over people's heads. Uh, well, well, I guess that's why I you're just, That's why you're working for the school board. I guess board. that's why I can read. All right. It says Karen. Magnet. Okay. Read the other word. Mm. There's a second word there. Karen Magnet. Yeah, there you oh, go. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. okay. I mean, it attracts. You know what a magnet does? Hmm? You know what a magnet does? No, I doesn't. I don't. <laughs> you doesn't? No, I doesn't. I doesn't. <laughs> no wonder why you work for the police mm. department. Yes. Wow. Thug. This right here, people, get a very good look. People ask me, what does tyranny look like in our country? This is what it looks like. Thank God I have it on a live stream. Okay. So now I'm being asked to leave? Yes. Okay, will. so if I don't leave, I'll be arrested. Just say yes, and I'll be out of here. Mm-hmm. Okay. You just said, mm-hmm. All right. Under threat of arrest, I'll leave. Look at this. Right there, they have the American flag. This is what tyranny looks like. This is our government, and this is the tyranny that they uh, that they sit there and breathe. Thugs, the enforcers, right here, Duval County. Shame. Well, Lana, all you had to do was go see their uh, PR representative. I mean, they asked you to do it, and yet uh, you still refused to do so because, well, any member of the press would go see the uh, uh, public uh, representative of that particular area. Well, that just goes to show that, well, you are not pressed to begin with. So, Lana, you can go ahead and go to Joey and cry all you want about being trespassed from another school property. And uh, while you do that, we'll go ahead and enjoy this uh, classic video of a, another frauditor crying about his camera being touched. Oh, my, oh, my. Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Corpus Christi, Texas, with a frauditor by the name of American Press Corps, as he attempts to audit the water utilities of that town, only to get touched and whine and cry about it. And by the way, this video is almost 40 minutes long, so there was a lot of quality content I had to cut out. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. American Press Corps here giving you another raw video. Today, we are going to audit 
and see if they respect and honor my right to video and film in public from government buildings uh, without being harassed, all right? So we are here today at the Water Utilities, guys. All right? There have been a lot of complaints about Corpus Christi Water. I mean, they make rap songs about it. I'm not even kidding. I mean, Corpus Christi Water is known for just being trash, okay? Now, today, I am trying to see if they have fixed those problems. He had to come around to this door because the front door was locked. But notice what the sign here says. It's telling him to go to the front door and to sign in. But no, he's not going to do that because he thinks he has the right to roam around the place because it's government funded. Hey, sir, I was just wondering if you could tell me where the main uh, the front desk is. Uh, go this way. You go straight, take a left, then take a right, and then when you get to the end of the hall, take another right, and then take a left. Thank you. Hey. Yeah. Hey, I was just uh, wondering, where's the front desk? The front desk is at the very, very, like, when you walk in, we, uh, it says Alyssa Garcia on the door. Alyssa, so I go straight through here and make a left? Yes. Okay. No, you make a right. Make a right? Yeah, and then you take a left. Okay, yes. thank you, sir. Appreciate yeah. it. Sorry. Guys, it's like a little maze back here. Hey, how are you? How can I help you, sir? Uh, yeah, I was just, uh, trying to wonder, I guess, make my way to the front desk. Okay. It's over there? Okay, thank you. Hello? Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hi. It's okay, um, I was hoping, uh, I'm... I could speak to like um, who's in charge of like the the water and the stuff in it, contaminants and like cleaning it. You know what? Let me go ask this lady. Hi. Um, Hold on one second. Sir. Okay. Hey. Are you me. looking for anyone in specific? Uh. Well. Can, can, I, can I help you with something? Or get help, boy. Yeah. You know, um, there was some reports about the water having too much ammonia and it was causing the you know it was cause, causing like a an off balance in the water um, okay. yeah so I didn't know if you guys had maybe got to the bottom of that I actually worked on the wastewater side I don't work on the water side like I said before there's a lot of stuff I had to cut out so I'm just gonna go ahead and skip ahead 15 minutes later hey so what was your name why does it matter? Oh, because uh, you're a public employee, correct? Okay, and who are you? If, if you don't mind me asking, if you just wait outside, I'll get somebody for you. If you okay. can follow me, huh? we'll just, just wait outside. Oh, is this a restricted area? Yes, uh, yes sir. we're supposed to be. Employed. Oh, can you show yeah. me where it says that? Come on, if you don't mind, yeah. Yeah. I'll just show well, you outside. Will you, will you show me outside? where it says restricted? And Yes, yeah. you need to be a city employee to be in here? Yeah. We need you to come up to the front. Oh, because I was let in. Uh, well, I don't know who I let don't, you in. Yeah, we don't. I don't know who let you in. But yeah. you be in there. We need to find out who let you in. You need okay. to come up to the lobby. You can't be just um, walking around the building. Can you show me where it says that I can't be here? Sir, we're just telling you that. Thank you for your coat. Okay. Yes, yeah, 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 here, please take a seat right now. Yeah. Yeah, you can have a seat and we'll get somebody sir, for you. Sir, this isn't going to joke. We'll call the police. It's up to you. Please have a seat. Sir, I'm not intimidated, sir. Sir, I'm not either. Okay, I'll can you, I'm just, I'm can just you, letting you know. Will you show me where please it says... Please have a seat. Sir, please have a seat. Will you show me where it says restricted? <laughs> oh, show me the signs. Show me the signs. Well, if we did show you the signs, you'd still demand access to it, even though it's not a public forum. Sir, what, what are you what, trying to prove here? I'm just asking what, you... We're just asking you kindly... Goes yeah, but lobby. I'm also being kind, and I would like and to so know. We, we have, we have oh, here. What is your business here, sir? Hi, sir. What is your name? My name is Tom. Tom, and what is your position here? 
I'm the maintenance manager for wastewater. The maintenance manager? That's right. Are you? Do you oversee these gentlemen? Are you their no, boss? I'm not. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I was let in by uh, an employee, so the front door didn't say uh, restricted or anything like that. It did say to um, sign in. However, you know, signing in is just a request. It's not necessarily law. Okay. So considering... says a sign in here, so you need to check it. All visitors must check in. Yeah. Look at the door over here. Yeah. All the signs are going to a new, new tent on it. <laughs> okay. So there are no signs? The sign's not there right now, no. Okay. So um, I have every right to be here as a taxpayer? No, sir. This is still for city employees only, and you are not a city employee. You have a city ID badge. Pardon me, sir, but this guy is a First Amendment auditor, which he believes that gives him the right to be anywhere he wants to be, no matter how much you protest. So just step, step aside. Oh, wait a minute. That doesn't give him any right, extra rights than any of us. It's just some made-up concept by other people to make these people feel important when they're actually not. A city ID badge? Do you have a city ID badge, sir? Do I need a city ID badge? Yes, you do, sir. You need a city to, ID badge. In order to occupy this facility, you do. Okay. So if you do not have one, you need to vacate. Okay. I'm asking you, you that now because now you're breaking the law. Okay, can you show me that law? Yeah, as soon as the police get here, we'll show it to you. Okay. Absolutely. Is there anything that says restricted or any signs like that that says I'm not supposed to be here? I'm gonna, I'm gonna go stand over here and talk. Maybe you can over here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Come on out here, bud. I guess you'll mull time. You're out. We know. I'm, I'm looking for That's a sign. Maybe matter. it's on the back of the door. The right. It's outside. I don't care who you are. You it's do not have the right. I don't so have please the, sit in here. Where you belong. Have the right to what? You don't have the right to be inside this hallway, sir. You can go ahead and put your camera in my face all you want. You don't intimidate me either. Thank you very much. Just please step down here, and we'll be with you momentarily. Yep. The police will be with you shortly. Thank you. Oh, my goodness, Frauditor. Looks like you picked the wrong place to audit. These guys are not intimidated by you. In fact, in the next few minutes, you're going to be left out in the cold to go home and cry in your pillow tonight. How about that? Let's let it go. Let's let, this, let that go. Sir, sir, you're, you're no. assaulting me. You're no, assaulting me. You. You're, 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 touching you're me. in my space. I was standing here first. I was standing here first. Sir? You're touching me. Sir, back Steve, away. Steve, Steve. Don't step back. You're Please. touching me. Please like and subscribe, guys. This guy is fucking ridiculous. You're a you touched me. This guy's ridiculous. You're you're ridiculous. You know, there's not a single sign that says. It doesn't matter. You know, if you guys don't, matter. if you guys yeah, don't up. want people here, that's all right. Back up, sir. You're just trying to start something. I don't know what you're trying to instigate, but you need to back up. You're gonna up. assault me with the door. You need to back up, sir. You're not a police officer. It doesn't matter. You're trespassing. You're breaking the law. Please move. Excuse me, sir. Have you checked into this window right here with, your, with our front desk? Sir, is that law? You're trespassing, sir. There's a sign sir. right here that directs all visitors to check in. Is your that a desk. law, sir? If you do not check in, please step away from the door. Is that a law? Trespassing. You're trespassing. That is breaking the law. You're breaking the law. Can you show me where it says You are trespassing. You are breaking the law. Can you show me where it says restricted? Hey, hey, hey. You don't. You don't. They're on their way. So I talked to the chief. Yeah. They're on their way. You're, you're welcome to have a seat and wait for the police department to show up. Well, I want to know where it says that I cannot be here, especially when I was let in by an, a city employee. So there are no signs. I was let in, and then you guys come and attack me. This man assaulted me. No, this man didn't assault me. Oh, yes, you did. did. You hit me with the door. No. Yeah, you got in my face, and you hit me with your arm. No. Yep, I have it on video. All I do is... And my are there cameras in here? Look, there's a camera right there. That's good. And, and witnesses, witnesses, are you going to lie under oath? Are you going to lie under oath? I did not see him touch you. Okay, so there's the lie number one. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I want you to see this man right here, what his lying face looks like. 
Sorry, folks, it's time to skip ahead. I mean, I hate to cut out all this quality content by this YouTube law expert, a graduate of Chile de Castro School of Law. I mean, I know how valuable your time is, so I don't want to waste it. Many, many minutes later. Since I was already here, there are no signs that say I cannot be here. Now, that is very important legally, right. okay? There are no restricted area signs. There's nothing like that that says that. Now, that's very important legally. Now, as I'm walking right here, I am bombarded by these men, these right. intimidating guys who want to try to intimidate me. This guy right here on camera is getting physical, sir. He gets physical? He's getting physical. Okay. Now, listen, if he apologizes, all right, I'll let this go because he's ignorant, sir. Okay. All right, he's just ignorant. That's all it is. Well, do you want to report me? Listen, sir, do you want me to file a police report or will you just say that you handled it? unprofessionally, and it won't happen like that again next time. That's all I ask. I'd like to file a report. Okay. Oh, wow. So, okay. since you're a victim? I'm not a victim. Will you say that? You said he assaulted you? Do you have your name? Did he yeah. ever Did he ever put hands on you or your items? Oh. All right. At this moment, I choose to remain silent, yeah. and I won't say a word without my attorney. Hey, crybaby, what happened to all that bravado? Now that he wants to file charges too, you are all of a sudden backing down. What a whiny little crybaby you've been. If you want to arrest me, you can arrest me. Well, you're the victim. I'm, tr I'm just trying to write a report for you. Yeah, I understand. What's your name? Concerned citizen. Okay. For a victim, we, ha we have to have a name. Okay. Well, guess what? I'm not going to give my name. Okay. Um, then I can't make a report. Oh, shucks. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to apologize? I'd like to follow. Oh, okay. okay. So you and need what, his what, information. What so was, uh, now this. Wait, 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 sir. Will you, you tell him that there's a, yeah. that there is a penalty for a false police report? Will you tell him that? Let him know. I have it. You know what? If you want, I'll show you on video. I have it all on video. I was filming like this. Okay. Well, okay. I, I I don't know exactly. We'll go from there. All right. So you may want to tell him not to file a false police report. Yeah, Seriously. We definitely don't want anything like that. Um, well, eventually two supervisors arrive and allow him to stay in the lobby, but they don't let him go in the back. But what a shame that this guy was allowed to waste police resources like this, just so he could try to cause a problem where none should have existed to begin with. <laughs> Well, hello and welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we find ourselves in Corpus Christi, Texas, with a frauder by the name of American Press Corps, as he attempts to audit the water utilities of that town, only to get touched and whine and cry about it. And by the way, this video is almost 40 minutes long, so there was a lot of quality content I had to cut out. So, sit back, relax, and enjoy the show. I can press score here, giving you another raw video. Today, we are going to audit and see if they respect and honor my right to video and film in public from government buildings uh, without being harassed, all right? So, we are here today at the Water Utilities, guys, all right? There have been a lot of complaints about Corpus Christi Water. I mean, they make rap songs about it. I'm not even kidding. I mean, Corpus Christi water is known for just being trash, okay? Now, today, I am trying to see if they have fixed those problems. He had to come around to this door because the front door was locked. But notice what the sign here says. It's telling him to go to the front door and to sign in. But no, he's not going to do that because he thinks he has the right to roam around the place because it's government funded. Hey, sir, I was just wondering if you could tell me where the main uh, the front desk is. Uh, go this way. You go straight, take a left, then take a right, and then when you get to the end of the hall, take another right, and then take a left. Thank you. Hey. Yeah. 
Hey, I was just uh, wondering, where's the front desk? The front desk is at the very, very, like, when you walk in, we, uh, it says Alyssa Garcia on the door. Alyssa, so I go straight through here and make a left? Yes. Okay. No, you make a right. Make a right? Yeah, and then you take a left. Okay, yes. thank you, sir. Appreciate yeah. it. Sorry. Guys, it's like a little maze back here. Hey, how are you? How can I help you, sir? Uh, yeah, I was just uh, trying to wonder, I guess, make my way to the front desk. Okay. It's over there? Okay, thank you. Hello. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hi. It's okay. Um, I was hoping uh, I'm, I could speak to like um, who's in charge of like the the water and the stuff in it, contaminants and like cleaning it. You know what? Let me go ask this lady. Hi. Um, Hold on one second. Okay. Hey. Are you looking for anyone in specific? Uh, well, can, yeah, I, can I help you with something or get help for you? Yeah, you know, um, there was some reports about the water having too much ammonia and it was causing the, you know, it was cause, causing like a, an off balance in the water. Um, okay. Yeah, so I didn't know if you guys had maybe got to the bottom of that. I actually work on the wastewater side. I don't work on the water side. Like I said before, there's a lot of stuff I had to cut out, so I'm just going to go ahead and skip ahead. 15 minutes later. Hey, so what was your name? Why does it matter? Oh, because uh, you're a public employee, correct? Okay, and who are you? If, if you don't mind me this? asking, if well, you can just wait outside and I'll get somebody for you. If you okay. can follow me, huh? we'll just... Just wait outside. Oh, is this a restricted area? Yes. Uh, yes sir. City. Oh, can you show yeah. me where it says that? Come on, if you don't mind. Yeah. yeah. I'll just show will, you outside. Will you show me outside. where it says restricted and? Yes. Yeah. You need to be a city employee to be in here. Yeah. Huh? We need you to come up to the front. Oh, because I was let in. Uh, well, I don't know who I let don't, you in. Yeah, we don't. I don't know who let you in, but you yeah. shouldn't be in. Here. We need to find out who let you in. You need okay. to come up to the lobby. You can't be just um, walking around the building. Can you show me where it says that I can't be here? Sir, we're just telling you that. Thank you for your coat. Okay. Right here, yes, you know, yeah, yeah, right here, please take a seat right now. Yeah, you can have a seat and we'll get somebody sir, for you. Sir, this isn't going to joke. We'll call the police. It's up to you. Please have a seat. And sir, we'll help you. I'm not intimidated, sir. Sir, I'm not either. Okay, I'll can you, I'm just, I'm can just you, letting you know. Will you show me where please it says? Please have a seat. Sir, please have a seat. Will you show me where it says restricted? <laughs> oh, show me the signs. Show me the signs. Well, if we did show you the signs, you'd still demand access to it, even though it's not a public forum. Sir, I, what are you trying to prove here? I'm just asking we're, you. We're just asking you kindly to go yeah, straight in the lobby. but I'm also being kind, and I would like and to so know. So we, 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 we have, we have oh, policies here. What is your business here, sir? Hi, sir. What is your name? My name is Tom. Tom, and what is your position here? I'm the maintenance manager for Wastewater. The maintenance manager? That's right. Are you? Do you oversee these gentlemen? Are you their no. boss? I'm not. Oh, okay. Um, yeah, I was let in by uh, an employee, so the front door didn't say uh, restricted or anything like that. It did say to um, sign in. However, you know, signing in is just a request. It's not necessarily law, okay? So considering... It says to sign in here, so you need to check it. All visitors must check in. Yeah. Look at the door over here. Yeah. All the signs are gone, so the new, new tent on it. <laughs> okay. So there are no signs? The sign's not there right now, no. Okay. So um, I have every right to be here as a taxpayer? No, sir. This is still for city employees only, and you are not a city employee. Do you have a city ID badge? Pardon me, sir, but this guy is a First Amendment auditor, which he believes that gives him the right to be anywhere he wants to be, no matter how much you protest. So just step, step aside. Oh, wait a minute. That doesn't give many extra rights than any of us. It's just some made-up concept by other people to make these people feel important when they're actually not. A city ID badge? Do you have a city ID badge, sir? Do I need a city ID badge? Yes, you do, sir. You need a city to, ID badge. In order to occupy this facility, you do. 
Okay. So if you do not have one, you need to vacate. Okay. I'm asking you, you that now because now you're breaking the law. Okay, can you show me that law? Yeah, as soon as the police get here, we'll show it to you. Okay. Absolutely. Is there anything that says restricted or any signs like that that says I'm not supposed to be here? <laughs> I'm going to go stand over here and talk. Maybe more talk over here. Come on. Come on out here, bud. I'll get you up all the time. You're up. I'm, I'm looking for a sign. Maybe it's on the back of the door. The right. It's outside. I don't care who you are. You it's do not have the right. I don't so have please the, sit in here where you belong. You don't have the right to what? You don't have the right to be inside this hallway, sir. You can go ahead and put your camera in my face all you want. You don't intimidate me either. Thank you very much. Just please step down here. And we'll be with you momentarily. Yep. The police will be with you shortly. Thank you. Oh my goodness, Frauditor. Looks like you picked the wrong place to audit. These guys are not intimidated by you. In fact, in the next few minutes, you're going to be left out in the cold to go home and cry in your pillow tonight. How about that? Let's let it go. Let's let that go. Sir, sir, you're, you're nope. assaulting me. You're nope, assaulting me. You're, you. you're, you're, you're in my space. I was standing here first. I was standing here first. Sir, you're touching me. Sir, back Steve, away. Steve, Steve. Nope. Let's step back. You're Please. touching me. Please like and subscribe, guys. This guy is fucking ridiculous. You're a <laughs> you touched me. This guy's ridiculous. You're you're ridiculous. Yeah, you know, there's not a single sign that says it doesn't matter. Well, you know, if you guys don't, if you guys yeah, don't want people here... That's all right. Back up, sir. You're just trying to start something. I don't know what you're trying to instigate, but you need to back you're up. You're going to assault me with the door. You need to back up, sir. You're not a police officer. It doesn't matter. You're trespassing. You're breaking the law. Please move. Excuse me, sir. Have you checked into this window right here with, your, with our front desk? Sir, is that law? You're trespassing, sir. right here that directs all visitors to check in. Is that a law, sir? Do not check in. Please step away from the door. Is that a law? Trespassing. You're trespassing. That is breaking the law. You're breaking the law. Can you show me where it says You are trespassing. You are breaking the law. Can you show me where it says restricted? Hey, hey, you don't. You don't. They're on their way. So, I talked to the chief. Yeah. They're on their way. You're, you're welcome to have a seat and wait for the police department to show up. Well, I want to know where it says that I cannot be here, especially when I was let in by an, a city employee. So there are no signs. I was let in, and then you guys come and attack me. This man assaulted me. No, this man didn't assault me. Oh, yes, you did. did. You hit me with the door. No. Yeah, you got in my face, and you hit me with your arm. No. Nope. Yep, I have it on video. All I do is... And my are, are there cameras in here? Look, there's camera right there. That's good. And, and witnesses, witnesses, are you going to lie under oath? Are you going to lie under oath? I did not see him touch you. Okay, so there's a lie number one. Ladies and gentlemen of the jury, I want you to see this man right here, what his lying face looks like. Sorry, folks, it's time to skip ahead. I mean, I hate to cut out all this quality content by this YouTube law expert, a graduate of Chile de Castro School of Law. I mean, I know how valuable your time is, so I don't want to waste it. Many, many minutes later. Since I was already here, there are no signs that say I cannot be here. Now, that is very important legally, right. okay? There are no restricted area signs. There's nothing like that that says that. Now, that's very important legally. Now, as I'm walking right here, I am bombarded by these men, these right. intimidating guys who want to try to intimidate me. This guy right here on camera is getting physical, sir. He gets physical. He's getting physical. Okay. Now listen, if he apologizes, all right, I'll let this go because he's ignorant, sir. All right, he's just ignorant. That's all it is. Well, do you want a report made? Listen, sir, do you want me to file a police report or will you just say that you handled it unprofessionally and it won't happen like that again next time? That's all I ask. I'd like to file a report. Okay. Oh, wow. So, okay. since you're a victim? I'm not a victim. Well, you said that he assaulted you. Do you have your name? Did he ever? Did he ever put hands on you or your items? Oh. All right. At this moment, I choose to remain silent, he and did. I won't he, say a word without my attorney.
Hey, crybaby, what happened to all that bravado? Now that he wants to file charges too, you are all of a sudden backing down. What a whiny little crybaby you've been. If you want to arrest me, you can arrest me. Well, you're the victim. I'm, tr I'm just trying to write a report for you. Yeah, I understand. What's your name? Concerned citizen. Okay. For a victim, we, ha we have to have a name. Okay. Well, guess what? I'm not going to give my name. Okay. Um, then I can't make a report. Oh, shucks. Yeah. Okay. Do you want to apologize? I'd sir? like to file. Oh, okay. okay. So you and need what, his what, information. What so was I... Now this... Wait, 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 wait. wait. Sir, will you tell him that there's a, that there is a penalty for a false police report? Will you tell him that? Let him know. I have it. You know what? If you want, I'll show you on video. I have it all on video. I was filming like this. Okay. Well, I, I, I don't know exactly. We'll go from there. All right. Sir, you may want to tell him not to file a false police report. Yeah, Seriously. We definitely don't want anything like that. Um. Well, eventually two supervisors arrive and allow him to stay in the lobby, but they don't let him go in the back. But what a shame that this guy was allowed to waste police forces like this just so he could try to cause a problem where none should have existed to begin with.